Greetings and welcome to the lab. Wiring LEDs in series versus parallel. Let's take a look. Except in certain cases, LEDs are generally wired with one resistor, like this. A properly chosen resistor will limit how much current can go through the LED. Now, if you want to light more than one LED, you have two choices. You can wire it in series or wire it in parallel. Let's look at parallel. If you take those that simple example and you stack it on top of itself and you wire the ends together, you get parallel. Parallel requires less voltage but more current. And if one of the LEDs goes out, the rest of them remain lit. Alternatively, if you take that example, that simple LED example, and you line them up end to end, you get series. Series requires more voltage, but less current. The caveat is that if one of the LEDs goes out, it disconnects the whole circuit so all of the LEDs go out. This is what happens with Christmas lights sometimes. Now, back on the parallel, if we look at that again, we've got a resistor for every single LED. If we were to combine the resistors into one, we could simplify the circuit. Back on series, if we combine the resistors into one, we can simplify the circuit. This requires understanding the combination of resistors in series or the resistors in parallel. There is also a concept called series parallel. That one I think we're going to leave for another video. That's pretty much it. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments. Uh, check the description to see if there's any updates to this. Sometimes we make mistakes. If there isn't a quick answer or a video already available, we'll consider making another video. Thank you so much for watching. Take care of yourself, and I hope you learned something.